Okay, so as a request, we're gonna show you how to use the Scuba 2 testing kit. And I'm gonna show how easy it is to use. My daughter is holding the camera for me. <laughs> so here's our hot tub. And the first thing we're gonna do is take a sample. So we can take the lid off and dip it under the water, as you can see. And then put the lid back on. And the first thing we need to do is zero it by pressing the on and then pressing the, te uh, the zero button in the middle. It'll start to flash, as you can see. And then when it goes to a solid zero, that's us calibrating. Now we're ready to do our samples. The, we're gonna first test the pH level. So on this particular one, we're going to use the phenol red, okay? So the first thing we need to do is squeeze the tablet out so that it drops into here, as you can see. And then what we need to do is crush the tablet using the plastic stirrer that comes with it. That's a little bit fiddly to begin with, but as you can see, we're just doing that now. Okay, so make sure it's all crushed up. And we stir it to make sure it's all gone. Okay, now we can put the lid back on. And the first thing we need to do is give it a little swell for 15 seconds. And then we can change the mode. And this one we're going to test is the pH. So we put it on pH and we leave it for another 15 seconds. So we've only got another five seconds for it to sit. And then we can press test. And now it's going to test. And we can see the pH level is 7.3, which we're happy with, which is cool. So now, we can test the others. Okay, so now we're gonna test the chlorine level. So um, in order to do that, we need to change the mode to CL. Um, we have a new water sample and we need to squeeze one of the uh, DP1 tablets, which, there we go, much better that time. And now again, we can crush the tablet this one is a little bit easier okay make sure it's uh, fully crushed you can see there's a little bit left there so just make sure the tablet's fully crushed and then again we need 15 seconds of just swirling it round Okay, and then we leave it to set for another 15 seconds. And then we can press test. And now it's looking. And we can see the current parts per million is 2.3. So I need to uh, raise the level because uh, in a hot tub we really want it higher than 